I'm going to list off the top five. I'm going to give you the countdown, like Casey Kasem, everybody. I'm going to give you the top five dummies right now in Impact Wrestling. Coming in at number five, everybody. As I look around here, I see Impact Zone. It's going to be the fans of Impact. Dummy. Yeah. Dummy. Yeah. Yeah. Because each and every time I look out there, I say, Eli Drake, and you guys go, sex, shut up. <laughs> because you know, you know what that is? That's called jealousy. And you know what that comes from? That comes from the undeniable Kavorka of Eli Drake. Because the guys want to be me, and the ladies will trust me. Oh, they want to see me. Yeah. But let's go down the list. Yeah. Number four yeah. dummy coming in next. Yeah. A man who likes to eat his bananas, Austin Aries. Dummy. Yeah. Yeah. More on that later. Number three dummy right here in Impact Wrestling. We're looking at who? Impact Management. Dummy. Yeah. Yeah. Well, that's a little stiff, Josh. Shut up. That's not time for you to cheer. I stand here, and I'm going to go ahead and name number two dummy. Are you ready for this? This is a hot story right now. Number two dummy, again, it's the fans of Impact. Dummy, yeah. Yeah. Dummies, did you break your button again? Yeah. Dummies. Yeah. Now, let's go ahead and move on to number one dummy. It's a very prestigious honor to be in this category, but everybody says this guy's on a roll, but I call him a crash side half-wit, and the other thing I call him is... Dummy. Yeah. Yeah. Dummy. Yeah. Yeah. Dummy. Yeah. Yeah. And his name... Moose. Whoa. They say he's on a roll. They say he's just mowing down opponents. But why don't we go ahead and just rewind our mind a little bit and let's go think back to when I made a deal for that world title case and he said, Dude, I, I, I think uh, I'll take your tag team title case. And I said, No, nah, no, nah, dummy. Come on down here and let me take that world title case. And guess what I did? I took my world title case. Dummy. Yeah. Yeah. All you got to worry about is Slammiversary is right around the corner. So next week, Moose wants to go ahead and challenge me one-on-one. -on -one. The winner of that goes on to Slammiversary to face Austin Aries for that title. And guess what? You've got one choice for the man who it's going to be. First class ticket, boom, on that gravy train. And that's not an insult. That. Look out. Moose is not someone that's going to sit in the back and listen to these insults from Eli Drake. 6'5", 295, maybe the best pure athlete in Impact Wrestling. All right, cut the stupid music, we're gonna get it. Eli, Eli, Eli. We all know you have the cheesiest one-liners here in Impact Wrestling, so congratulations. But I'm sitting back there listening to you call me the number one dummy on your stupid list. But the last time I checked, not only did you lose your tag team titles, but you lost your world title match to Pentagon. So, not only are you a dummy, You are also 
a loser. And we all know that Eli Drake. You don't understand. I don't need gold because I am gold. Oh, and Eli Drake with a cheap shot to Moose. Great sucker punch. Eli Drake trying to get the jump on Moose before their match next week, and the plan backfired. Oh, and a low blow. That's what you come to expect from Eli Drake. Took advantage of a situation there. Gravy While Moose train. was showboating. Gravy train on Moose. If that happens next week, Eli Drake may punch his ticket to Slammiversary on July 22nd. What's he doing now? So no, 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 he's no, gonna no, make no. a statement and crush Moose with that podium. Eli Drake. You know, Don, you talked about seeing the other side of athletes over the last number of weeks here in Impact. I think we just saw an other side of Eli Drake. Yeah, we saw the vicious side, and I think if we see that side more often, gold will be in the future of Mr. Drake. So next week here on Impact, it will be Eli Drake versus Moose in a number one contenders match for the World Championship. The winner of that match next week is going to Slammiversary.